I think it's pretty safe to say that when it comes to WandaVision, a lot of the conversation has been who the hell could possibly show up next and which direction are they going in? And are the surprises going to keep coming? And as we've been seeing with WandaVision, the answer is yes. So it's good to know that this is going to carry over into the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. So as most of you know, when it comes to the upcoming first season of the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, we have been told that we can expect a few new things to show up in this that are sort of going to bring in the new status quo for the MCU and many of the characters. Now, how far and wide that goes, we really have no idea. There's plenty of rumors out there from the introduction of the mutants to the likes of Madame Hydra possibly showing up in Madripoor to Wolverine having a cameo to multiple other things. And we really have no idea because the Falcon and the Winter Soldier has had far less leaks than the first season of WandaVision. Now recently in an interview with E! Online, MCU's Emily Von Camp, who plays Sharon Carter, talked a little bit about this and about transitioning from the films over onto the TV side of things, and she said that this series at its core is a old school action packed film that people love these days. My guess is if you look at it, it's sort of like your Mission Impossible and your Winter Soldier, right? It's that type of film. Now going further, she did reveal that there would be multiple levels of teases and surprises that the fans can look forward to, which are very similar to what they've been doing with WandaVision. My guess is going to be that this can extend from smaller things, like for example, having mentions of what's happening with some of the other characters, or maybe having these characters phone in or something, right? Something along those lines, to bigger moments, such as Don Cheadle appearing as War Machine. He confirmed that. He probably should now in an interview, but he did, so we can expect something like that. I would assume that since this is a show that's not in the multiverse, that's not messing with realities and all these unique elements, that this show is more open to some of these crossovers and surprises more so than WandaVision's first season was. And I really won't be surprised if we do end up seeing some more minor MCU characters make cameos or just get name dropped or even, you know, like a phone call or send a video message or something from like Hawkeye, for example, right? Because that's pretty easy to handle. And it makes sense in the context of this show. And again, if we look at the likes of Black Widow, for example, we can probably expect she might make a cameo at the end. I mean, that would make sense. By that I mean Yelena, not like the dead reanimated corpse of Black Widow herself, although you never know, really. But yeah, I'm getting real excited. I mean, it's my most anticipated thing from the MCU, so I'm, I'm, I'm really hyped. So I want to know what they're going to give us. What do you guys think? Is there like Hail Mary 1, here's your big cameo? Chris Evans? Probably not.